What you doing, Nigga Dreamers? You got Mathers back with more Pokemon Showdown with that Mian Xiao Yu Yu team. Um, yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> and you know what? While I'm here, I just want to let everybody know make sure to hit that subscribe button. Just so you know when the next video comes out. Uh, came out with a video of this, with this team yesterday. We'll come out with another one tomorrow, most likely. So if you are interested, make sure to hit that subscribe so you can be notified when things come out. It comes on your home screen, and if you hit the bell, then you'll actually get like a real notification and stuff. And now back to the actual video with the battle. And my opponent has a very scary team. And by scary, I mean... He's got Darmanitan, he's got a Shell Smash, and a Copper Raja. Okay. I like that Mian Xiao clicks all kinds of buttons versus this guy. Um, I'm going to lead Mian Xiao. Does Mian Xiao get Taunt? I might need to put Mian Xiao on like every team that I have. Slash learn Mian Xiao. It does seem, yeah, it does seem like a, a Pokemon that would get taunt. <laughs> it would run like a max HP, max speed taunt Mian Xiao. Okay, Starmie. Now, I know Scarf Starmie is not a very common thing, so I really want a U turn. Poo, big damage. Go T-Tar because I feel like he's gonna go for the psychic move. Yeah. Uh, no items. We could be like choice, or we could be like specs or something. Um, I could also just go for the rock polish, but he does have a, a mammoth, uh, mammoth swine. What am I saying? He has a copper haja. Um, although honestly, I feel like I could beat the rest of his team if I do get the rock polish weakness policy boost. So, that's a good thing to keep in mind. Uh, I'm gonna switch to Indeed. He get the Psychic Surge, as he does go for the Surf, which two hit KOs. Oh my. I don't like that, I'm gonna go Starmie. Hmm. Hit him with the Force. Um. Could go Poltergeist. Goes Darmanitan. I have Incineroar specifically for this. There's the U turn into the Seismitoad. Uh, while he could get rocks up, I'm just gonna Toxic him. Okay. Uh, maybe knockoff, honestly. <laughs> No, I should keep this healthy. I should keep this healthy. I'm just gonna go in D. I don't really know what else to switch into this thing. <laughs> the earthquake does knock me out. Um, but I think that means that I just go star me with my boots on and click extending force. And it doesn't knock him out as he goes for the knockoff. <laughs> So that's it for my um, my stuff. I'm gonna rapid spin, get the KO, get a critical hit, get the speed boost. Hello. Okay, shadow balls to knock me out. I understand. So the thing I need to keep in mind: the psychic terrain is up which means that uh, priority moves don't work, so I couldn't shadow sneak him right here, so I gotta go Mian Xiao. Wait a minute. Oh, right, I rapid spin. I forgot. I was like, wait, why are the rocks not up? Um, knock off is probably fine, because I can at least knock off the Sylveon. Wow, that rapid spin play was really cool. Um... Take a sip of water while he takes his time. Hmm. He was focused, Sash, too, damn. Okay, Darmanitan. 
Um, I mean, do I have any reason not to go Incineroar? Not really. See, so just U-turns again. Goes Sylveon. I mean, Aegislash, I have Aegislash, is basically only useful for this thing. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use it. Um, just go for an Iron Head, break the sub. I outspeed, which is pretty cool, as he calm minds. Uh, yeah, I'm going to Iron Head again. KO the Sylveon. <laughs> All right. Things are looking good for Mianxiao right now. Um, I can just hit him with a quick Shadow Sneak. Do some good damage as he earthquakes, and do I just go for it? Go Mianxiao, I got the scarf on, I hit him with the high jump kick. I mean, I don't think Kaparaja's living a high jump kick. Okay, Darmanitan is gone, Kaparaja comes in. Goodbye Kaparaja, GG. The scarf, reckless, what? Okay, just, I don't know if anyone saw that on the recording, but I typed GG and it looked like it didn't come up, but it was just because the thing had scrolled to like right here. <laughs> so it looked like mine didn't get sent and he just left, but it was just down here. Okay, let's get another battle. Let's get another battle. I love seeing Mianxiao put in work. Mianxiao is one of my favorite Pokemon. Okay, he's got a Raquinid, which is not great for my team. Got Araquanid Obstagoon, which is another Pokemon that I want to try using now that it is has been unbanned from UUBL. Uh, Terrakion, definitely a scary thing. Age Slash, Talonflame, Sylveon. So this is a, a game where it doesn't really look like Mianchad's going to put in that much work, unfortunately. But Tyranitar could. Tyranitar definitely could, unless he's like Will-O-Wisp, Talonflame, that could be really bad. But I feel like I can get a weakness policy boost off of the Sylveon if I get that opportunity. I was thinking about that in the last game, but I never really, never the opportunity never really presented itself. Um, so the problem is he's going to lead Arachnid and get Sticky Web up. And I don't quite know what to do about that. See, Taunt Mianxia, Taunt Mianxia. I guess I gotta leave Mianxiao, as he leads Obstagoon. Huh. Uh, I think I just U-turn, as he does Obstruct. Does that lower my defense? By two, yeah, wow. And he is the Guts set. So that's pretty scary, but I'm definitely gonna U-turn. As I still do big damage, all oh, right, because I didn't drop my attack. Uh, I think Incineroar is the play. Get the attack drop as he does go for the knockoff, not the facade, thank god. Um, he probably outspeeds me though. And the facade is just gonna blow me away unless I can make the hard reading of Aegislash. He actually goes Araquanid. I'm gonna Swords Dance because I do have Rapid Spin, and if I can just try to almost knock this out, <laughs> uh, this could be bad. Oh, that is a lot. But yeah, Liquidation is gonna destroy me. Um. Yeah, the problem is this thing's, especially with Sticky Web up, this thing is super good versus me. Um, I guess I could knock off. But I don't know if I like that. Because he's got Terrakion with the Justified as well. I don't know, I'm going to go in DD. There's a pretty good chance, yeah, yeah, I actually do still outspeed this thing so I could just click Expanding Force and knock him out. The goon is back. I think he's just gonna facade. 
I would. <laughs> I would. Uh. The question is, what do I need? Is, is Tyranitar actually looking good in this game anymore? I don't know. I mean, I lost Aegislash, which is my way of beating Sylveon, really. So I might need to hold on to Tyranitar to, to hold on to Tyranitar because it might be my only real way of beating Sylveon, unless Poison Jab really does enough. But I haven't done Calx or anything. Um, Talonflame actually is a good threat too, which I might need to keep Tyranitar around for as well. So, what's the what's the what's the deal here? Do I just sack Indeedy? I think I do. Oh, Mian Shao. And since I am Scarf, I can just click U turn. Even if he wants to obstruct, I'll still knock him out on the following turn. And what I do really want is if I can knock this out right now, or he goes Sylveon. And that actually does give me the opportunity to click Rapid Spin, potentially. Thank you. Okay, so the web is gone, which is actually huge. Um, and I can just get some big damage off on this. And the terrain is gone. And I think I just go T-Tar and hope he attacks me hell yes <laughs> um and heavy slam is super strong so <laughs> look at those stats look at those stats uh yeah that's cool does anything outspeed me now i mean a scarf terrakion probably could but if he doesn't go right into that, then maybe. Goes Obstagoon. Does go for the Obstruct. Okay. Understandable. Understandable. You know what would be cool? Like a... <laughs> an opposite of... Heavy slam, oh, heavy slam. What am I saying? An opposite of uh, stored power, move that gets stronger with each stat drop you have. I think that would be kind of interesting. Uh, okay, talent flame does knock me out with the brave bird. Unfortunately, um, I can just go incinerar and get the intimidate off, and maybe go for a parting shot. Or maybe go for a knockoff. Or maybe go for a toxic. I think I'll go for a toxic. See brave birds. Swords dance. As I hit him with the knockoff. Ooh. All right, yeah, I think that's game because I can't beat this thing. I can't beat both of these Pokemon with the moves that I have. Almost KO. As he goes for the Shadow Ball, which doesn't knock me out. The question is, does he have Shadow Sneak? He does. GG. GG, well played. Very well played. Let's try another one. Uniclus, Pangoro, Rotom Wash, Cobalion, Golisopod, Weezing. So. Golisopod, definitely, first impression is an issue. Indeed, it is. Um. Weezing could also be, well, I mean, I think Tyranitar 
with the heavy slam. Yeah, now that I really like Tyranitar here, if I can if I can manage to get a rock polish with my weakness policy off and the Glycopod is gone, then I think Tyranitar could definitely do it. Um, uh, I want to lead, excuse me, I want to lead me in Shao because it also puts in work. But the problem is he could lead Glycopod, which makes me want to lead Incineroar. And I feel like Incineroar takes a good amount from first impression, but anyway, I'm going to leave me on shout because he leads Cobalion. He doesn't have a fighting immunity, <laughs> so there's a potential that I could just destroy this thing right now. Okay, yeah, it goes wheezing. Good damage, good damage. <laughs> Not really. I can just go hard in DD. I see just strange steam, and holy crap, that did a lot. Now, the question here is do I predict the dark type Pangoro to come in and go for the Dazzling Gleam, or just click the Expanding Force? Because Pangoro is actually super scary. Goes Reuniclus, actually, pretty good in ground. But Incineroar should take this on unless he's Focus Blast. Future Sight. He could be Focus Blast. Uh, I'm just going to Parting Shot. Because I feel like he's going to switch. Nice. Um, this could actually set up. No, not yet. i got to get rid of this Glycopod first. So I'll go Mian Xiao. Uh, and I think this time I just click U-turn as it goes wheezing. He's not max speed, so I am going to go Aegislash. I take the future side attack, which I completely forgot about. Just go for an Iron Head. Ooh! As he does have Fire Blast. But that's okay, that's one less switch into Mian Xiao. Go indeed here, get my terrain back up. And, um. I mean, I really want to go. I mean, I think I don't have any reason not to go for the Dazzling Gleam. It's because it'll probably knock out the Weezing at 10%. Now he's Regenerator Uniclus. We go for another dazzling beam. I just want to see what movie goes for. Yeah. I think I just go Incineroar. I can. Parting shot. Yeah. He goes Rotom. I just want to click high jump kick. Is that such a horrible thing to do? It lived. And it will o wisp me. Very, very unfortunate circumstance. Very unfortunate circumstance. Especially since I didn't use expanding force at all. Um, Make the heart into Incineroar, switch, as it goes again for the future site. Uh, go for the knockoff. As Galizapod comes out, ooh, knock off the boots. Does a Flare Blitz do enough? I think I might just, well, he might first impression. Probably first impression. Yeah, maybe going Mian Xiao is actually the better play. Just let it go down, as it doesn't go down. Oh, but the future side attack. <laughs> uh, he could be speedy, but I don't think he's jolly. 
and I'll get an intimidate off on him too. Um, How much did the first knockoff do? 29. And I still need 20-ish percent to get him to emergency exit. Okay, he goes wheezing. Knock out the wheezing. Pangoro. Go Starmie because he'll probably not knock off. Oh, well. <laughs> Dang, Pangoro is a threat. Drain punches. Does that knock me out if you're intimidated? <laughs> I'm, thinking, I'm thinking of uh, Tyranitar here. He's just gonna first impression though. Yeah, I think it's over. <laughs> Unfortunately. I mean, I'll at least go for it. You know, he knocks me out. Even intimidated. GG. I actually outsped him, too. Huh, I guess I'm naturally faster. Weird. Anyway, uh, I guess that's gonna be it, guys for this one. Not a lot of victories, but that's okay. Uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Keep dreaming. Goodbye.